Embark on a fascinating journey through history as we explore the captivating story of Alexander the Great's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh. A legendary conqueror and visionary leader, Alexander the Great left an indelible mark on Egypt, reshaping its cultural and political landscape in ways that still echo through the ages. Join us as we delve into the life, legacy, and impact of one of history's most enigmatic figures. Historical Background and Context To understand Alexander's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh, it is essential to explore the historical backdrop against which his story unfolded. Born in 356 BC in the ancient Greek kingdom of Macedon, Alexander the Great was the son of King Philip II and Queen Olympias. Under the tutelage of the great philosopher Aristotle, Alexander honed his intellect and military prowess, laying the foundation for his future conquests. Upon the assassination of his father in 336 BC, Alexander ascended to the Macedonian throne and embarked on a series of ambitious military campaigns, rapidly expanding his empire across three continents. As Alexander's conquests spread eastward, the Persian Empire Musical crumbled under his might, leading to his eventual arrival in Egypt in 332 BC. The Persian Rule in Egypt Before Alexander's arrival, Egypt was under the rule of the Persian Empire. The Persians led by Cambyses II had conquered Egypt in 525 BC, and their rule was characterized by heavy taxation and disrespect for local traditions. As a result, the Egyptian population was unhappy with Persian rule and yearned for change. Macedonian Conquests and the Path to Egypt The path to Egypt for Alexander the Great was paved with a series of decisive victories over the Persian Empire. At the Battle of Issus in 333 BC, Alexander's forces defeated the Persians under King Darius III, forcing them to retreat to the east. This victory allowed Alexander to secure the Levant and Asia Minor before turning his sights towards Egypt. Alexander the Great's Arrival and Coronation in Egypt As we follow Alexander's footsteps into Egypt, we discover a nation ready to embrace the young conqueror as a liberator and leader. Upon his arrival, Alexander was warmly welcomed by the Egyptian people, who were wary of Persian rule and eager for change. Recognizing the importance of Egypt's strategic location and rich resources, Alexander sought to forge a strong alliance with the ancient civilization, honoring its customs and traditions in the process. In a powerful demonstration of his commitment to Egypt, Alexander journeyed to the desert oracle of Siwa to consult the god Amun. Legend has it that the oracle proclaimed him to be the son of a deity, confirming his divine status and reinforcing his claim to the Egyptian throne. Alexander was subsequently crowned pharaoh in Memphis, ushering in a new era of unity and prosperity for the land of the Nile. Alexander's Policies in Egypt During his time in Egypt, Alexander implemented policies aimed at winning the hearts and minds of the Egyptian population. He presented himself as a traditional Egyptian pharaoh and sought to respect and uphold the religious and cultural customs of the land. By doing so, Alexander demonstrated his commitment to the well-being of Egypt and its people, earning their loyalty and admiration in the process. Restoration of Egyptian Temples One of the key aspects of Alexander's rule in Egypt was the restoration and construction of Egyptian temples. These efforts were seen as a sign of respect for the religious traditions of the country and helped to further cement Alexander's position as a legitimate pharaoh in the eyes of the people. Among the temples that Alexander restored was the Temple of Luxor, a vital religious and cultural center in ancient Egypt. The Foundation of Alexandria one of the most enduring legacies of Alexander the Great's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh is the founding of the city of Alexandria. Named in his honor, this strategically located city on the Mediterranean coast would become a thriving center of trade, culture, and learning, symbolizing the confluence of Greek and Egyptian traditions under his rule. Alexandria quickly emerged as a bustling metropolis boasting impressive architectural marvels such as the Great Library and the Pharos Lighthouse, one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. 
the city served as a testament to Alexander's vision and ambition, attracting scholars, merchants, and artists from far and wide who flocked to its vibrant streets in search of knowledge, wealth, and inspiration. Alexandria's Architectural Wonders the city of Alexandria was home to some of the most impressive architectural wonders of the ancient world. In addition to the Great Library and the Pharos Lighthouse, Alexandria was also known for its grand palaces, luxurious bathhouses, and monumental temples. These structures exemplified the city's status as a cosmopolitan hub and reflected the prosperity and cultural achievements of the Hellenistic period. The Great Library of Alexandria Perhaps the most iconic symbol of Alexandria's intellectual and cultural achievements was the Great Library. Housing an extensive collection of scrolls and texts, the library served as a beacon of knowledge and learning, attracting scholars from across the ancient world. It is estimated that at its peak, the library held over 700,000 scrolls, covering subjects such as mathematics, astronomy, medicine, and philosophy. Cultural Exchange and Syncretism Alexander's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh marked a period of profound cultural exchange and syncretism between the Greek and Egyptian worlds. As the Hellenistic influence permeated Egypt, a fascinating fusion of ideas, beliefs, and artistic styles began to take shape, forever altering the course of both civilizations. During this time, we witnessed the rise of the Ptolemaic dynasty, which ruled Egypt for nearly three centuries after Alexander's death. This Greco-Egyptian royal family embraced and adopted many aspects of Egyptian culture, religion, and iconography, forging a unique, hybrid identity that resonated throughout the kingdom. This period of cultural syncretism also saw the emergence of a new pantheon of deities, blending the attributes and mythologies of Greek and Egyptian gods. Among the most notable of these hybrid gods was Serapis, a composite deity that combined elements of Osiris, Apis, and the Greek god Zeus. This fusion of religious traditions not only facilitated the assimilation of Greek settlers into Egyptian society, but also reflected the dynamic and inclusive nature of Alexander's reign. Military Achievements and Challenges while Alexander's rule as an Egyptian pharaoh brought about significant cultural and economic advancements, his time in Egypt was also marked by a series of military challenges and achievements. As we unearth the complexities of his reign, we'll discover a relentless warrior who sought to expand his empire and solidify his grip on the ancient world. During his time in Egypt, Alexander the Great launched a series of military campaigns aimed at consolidating his power and quelling any potential uprisings. Among these campaigns were his expeditions into the Libyan desert and his strategic victories over the remaining Persian forces in the region. These military accomplishments served to reinforce Alexander's status as a formidable conqueror and further integrate Egypt into his growing empire. The Battle of Gaza and the Conquest of Egypt One of the key battles that solidified Alexander's control over Egypt was the Battle of Gaza in 332 BC. In this conflict, Alexander's forces successfully defeated the remaining Persian garrison, thereby ensuring the stability and security of the region under his rule. This victory also allowed Alexander to maintain control over the strategically vital coastal route between Asia and Europe. Alexander's Departure and the Emergence of the Ptolemaic Dynasty Alexander's departure from Egypt in 331 BC marked the beginning of a new chapter in the nation's history. His trusted general, Ptolemy I. Soter, was appointed as the governor of Egypt laying the groundwork for the rise of the Ptolemaic dynasty. This period, which lasted from 323 to 30 BC, saw a continuation of the cultural exchange and syncretism that Alexander had initiated, resulting in the development of the unique Greco-Egyptian civilization that has captivated historians and archaeologists for centuries. The Legacy of Alexander the Great in Egypt the impact of Alexander the Great's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh can still be felt today, nearly 2,300 years after his death. 
His brief yet transformative rule in Egypt laid the groundwork for the flourishing Hellenistic period, which saw an unprecedented fusion of Greek and Egyptian culture, religion, and knowledge. The city of Alexandria remains a shining example of Alexander's vision and ambition. Its mystical history and remarkable archaeological treasures continue to captivate the world today. The cultural exchange and syncretism fostered during his reign have left an ineradicable mark on the history of Western civilization, influencing everything from art and philosophy to science and mathematics. Lasting Contributions to Science and Philosophy the intellectual and cultural achievements of the Hellenistic period which began during Alexander's reign have had a lasting impact on the development of Western thought. Scholars such as Euclid, Archimedes, and Eratosthenes made groundbreaking contributions to mathematics, physics, and astronomy, while philosophers like Plotinus and Philo of Alexandria continued the tradition of intellectual inquiry established by their Greek predecessors. The Spread of Hellenistic Culture The cultural exchange and syncretism initiated during Alexander's reign as an Egyptian pharaoh also played a crucial role in the spread of Hellenistic culture throughout the Mediterranean world. The diffusion of Greek and Egyptian ideas, art, and customs laid the foundation for the Roman and Byzantine empires, which would carry on the legacy of the Hellenistic Age for centuries to come. As we bring our journey through the life and reign of Alexander the Great, the Egyptian pharaoh, to a close, we are left with a profound appreciation for the complexity and depth of his influence on Egypt and the world. A conqueror, visionary, and cultural bridge builder, Alexander the Great's impact on Egypt transcended the boundaries of his brief reign, leaving a legacy that continues to inspire and intrigue. Through the lens of Alexander's story, we gain invaluable insights into the dynamic interplay of culture, politics, and power in the ancient world, and a deeper understanding of the indelible mark left by one of history's most enigmatic and transformative figures.